What's up, y'all? All right, so I am just going to jump right in and not wait for anyone to get on. I'm pretty sure this is not like, okay, sure it's public. I'm not sure. Anyway, so here's the deal. So if you do not know me, my name is Erica Nichols. I'm a hairstylist. I have been for, hey Jennifer, have been for um, eight or nine years. And um, I partnered with a hair care company almost two years ago. And I've been like loving it, the products, all that stuff. So there was a rumor recently, uh, right before um, our annual convention, that um, our company was coming out with skincare. And I was, to be honest with y'all, I was like, no, please don't. Um, because I just was like, there's no way they're going to do this because they're so proud of um, them being the only hair care company in the direct selling industry. So I just was like, they're not going to do it. They're not going to do it. They're not going to do it. But um, I also am like one of those where um, I don't like when companies try to compete with others or kind of get out of their own lane, if that's a fair statement. Um, so I was just thinking like, what are they doing? Like, and so anyways, they did, they announced it. They came out with skincare and um, I, I'm really excited, but I kind of was like, you know, I'm not going to talk about it. I'm not going to sell it. Like, I'm just going to like probably love it and use it myself. So anyways, I was thinking, um, you know, I, for the first time in my life, probably like in the past year or so, I have been very interested in finding a skincare routine that, um, you know, I loved. I'm real sensitive to smells. I cannot stand anything that's like really perfumey or high fragrance. It makes me have a headache, makes my throat close up, my eyes water swell. It makes me feel like absolute shit, just to be honest. Um, I cannot deal with perfume. So a lot of things that I did try as far as cleansers and, you know, serums, moisturizers, a lot of them I found that um, I didn't like because of the way it smelled. So um, I have gone through. <laughs> so this is what I just gathered up of stuff that I have bought, sampled, um, and probably in the past six months, um, I've bought like vitamin C serum, hyaluronic acid. Um, I recently, ooh, sorry, um, Drunk Elephant is one that I heard so many fabulous things about. Um, it's from Sephora, like, or Ulta, whatever, but, um, I, I wasn't I wasn't in love with any of this like it was all right but I didn't like the way the texture of it the way it went on or the way it smelled or something this was the least smelling stuff but um I have had other girls in direct sale companies send me samples of all their stuff um wasn't really sold on that I have their business cards in case I did want to buy it um I've gotten this from the hair supply store, Dermalogical. Um, you know, I've gotten all kind of stuff and none of it is really worth buying, in my opinion. Samples, um, Biore, I bought these little facial brushes, one vibrates, one doesn't. Like I've been all into it, okay y'all? Um, I mean, there's all kind of stuff. Like these are all samples from some girl that sent me. Um, Shout out to you, girl. Um, yeah, I appreciate it. What's her name? Here she is. Gina. You're the bomb, Gina. But, anyways, so, I kind of, oh, and the best thing that I really liked as far as cleanser was this. Seriously, cleaning cleaner like Walmart. Okay, so all that is probably not going to be used ever again because I got it. Okay, so I cannot wait to open this, so I was gonna open it with y'all. I have not like touched any of these bottles, packaging or anything. I've seen them, I've been, it's been rubbed in my face all week from everyone that got to purchase it. At my nations and pick it up at Will Call, I had issues with the app. It was saying my card was declined, like all three of them, and there's no way that they should have been. So I had to have mine shipped, so I just got it. And I'm so excited. Um, 
Hey, y'all. If y'all are watching live, type live in the uh, comments. And if you're watching replay, give me a replay in the comments. Okay. So, so freaking excited. <laughs> like, I'm kind of nervous, but kind of so excited. Yes, it's beautiful packaging. All right. So, um, there's two different lines that are um, one's for gentle, sensitive skin, and one is for balanced, more normal skin. So I got both of them. I got the I Want It All kit. So these are, I have no idea. I have no idea. Um, so yeah, I have absolutely no clue. So I'll figure that out later, and I'm not gonna say it's fabulous until I know it is. So just know that. Um, but as much as I love my hair, Perry, y'all, there's no way this is gonna be anything but amazing. I already know. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what all this is. All right, we got that, we got that. Um, yeah, that, scrub. This is really cool too, though. I do know what these are. These are strips, um, skin routine tester strips. And so um, this will help um, anyone determine what, um, what, which one they need, like the sensitive or the balanced. And there's one for your cheek, one for your forehead, you press it on there and then you like color coordinate it to whatever it says. All right. And then we also, I have posted this week of my hair. This is my 30 day hair. Um, we have a new shampoo and conditioner that just came out. This is good for coarse, curly, ethnic type um, you know, unmanageable type hair, the hair that needs like a relaxer or a lot of, um, prep work to smooth it out. They had given us samples of this. Um, so that was what I had used earlier this week and I loved it. Um, it was very, very, um, it's called super nourish oil cream shampoo with rejuvenique. So it's like very nourishing. So that's what this is the new um, shampoo and conditioner. So I'm gonna use all that later tonight um, and kind of figure out what, what's what. I have no idea, but I'm really excited. Hey, if anyone's on watching that already got theirs, where is that cute little spoon thing? Is that in here? Uh-oh, did I fall? My bad. Did anyone, does anyone know if that spoon thing is in one of these packages? Um, it's like a cute little rose gold like spoon dill is that in here do y'all know anyone that already got theirs i wonder sorry Luann. i didn't know that the that the thing fell the ipad um but anyway so i will keep y'all posted um again i'm not gonna you know go all into it until i know because i don't know what it does but i did already take my before pictures um i probably may take some more like an outside natural lighting um but yeah so because i heard that they they stressed really hard like make sure you get before pictures like it's super super serious in natural light smiling no filters no ring lights all that good stuff so i gotta do that i probably will take some more just to be on the safe side so i will keep y'all posted i'm so excited talk to y'all later